Chunks has done. Do we think the same featuring Philly and Harry is one of those, you know, agree, disagree, whatever, those kind of videos? I'm going to see if I agree with them. Here we go. He's about to say, yeah, no, yeah. Here we go. Hey, man, yeah, hey, man, yeah, yeah. Yo, my people, it's Chunks. Oh, and, um, yeah, man, we switched up a little bit. I got out of the house. I'm in the studio right now with the boys. On my left, I got who? Hey, it's without the sauce. And on my right. Yeah, man, it's your boy, Young Philly. And Mike's. Next time, Mike's. Right, so my people, you guys are probably thinking, what are we doing? Let me explain how this works. Today, the mandem are testing to see if we think the same. In round one, we'll be given four options, and we have to choose which option we prefer. In okay. Two, a statement will be read out, and we will have to reveal how strongly we agree or disagree with that statement. Let's get into the video. See, all right, so we're going to get four. I like this. There's two different rounds to it. I like it. I thought it was just an agree, disagree kind of thing, but yeah. Okay. okay. You write down the one that we would choose. Gymnastic. Yeah, yeah. Oh, choose one of four fans. Fans flavors, okay. No. I don't even need no more options. Orange, lemon, or fruit twist. Oh! All right, orange. Orange is obviously like the OG goat. Like, it is good. Lemon is so nice cold. Like, lemon cold. Like, a bit of ice. Oh! Like you go places, you're like, can I have a fancy limo? Oh. But I'm going to go fruit twist. Fruit twist is like, at any time I can have a fruit twist and I'll love it. It's got to be. Fruit twist. Now you're missing the best one. Pineapple. In three, Pineapple. two, one. Grape, Grape and orange. Orange. And I said, hey, everyone's got different flavors. Yeah, so I orange. picked Fanta Fruit Twist at first, but you know they've taken away the sugar. But I'm talking about nostalgia. Back in the yeah, day, yeah, Fruit yeah. Twist yeah, weren't right. Yeah, was the greatest of all time. It weren't right. Yeah, yeah, that, you can have that before lunch. If now I'm talking about on a consistency basis, orange. orange. Yeah, yeah. Especially in America and, and Africa. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Crazy. Oh, yeah, no, no. Nigerian Fanta Bottle. But there's actually orange there. Like ours is ours is like yellow. Everyone watching this right now understands what. I'm no, no, of course that's the. Back in the days, one. this went right. Summer, yeah, yeah. When, it, when it was in the fridge for about six hours. No, you, you just put it in your ears well. just to make sure it's cold. Right, yeah, it. <laughs> what? This Daily for twenty-seven what? months. Uh, I have watched it. Yeah. Right, right. right. It. Guys, choose one of three right, movies. Here we go. Ooh. White chicks, Borat, Friday, The Longest Yard. I'm oh, sorry. out of them, I'm gonna go Borat. I'm going Borat. Max, save it at 47 months. So, so, so. Longest yard is mental. Longest yard is sick. So sorry, man. I can't lie to you. I already wrote it. White chicks is the only one. Yeah, right Friday, answer, because yeah. Yeah. the thing about Friday is monumental to black culture. Yeah, you know what I'm trying to say? You know what I'm trying to say? No, no, black culture. You're trying to make me say Wait, that. Hold on, what I'm telling you? Let me see. Yeah, black. Yeah, yeah, black. yeah. yeah that's what I'm trying to say. Unreal. Unreal. Sorry, Unreal. Sorry, I'm choosing for it. No, no, great film. Longest Yard is incredible as well. Maybe apart from Borat, won't watch that. Yeah, Borat, not my thing. I don't think I've even watched it. Sasha Baron Cohen, that's Nico's thing. Nico loves that. For me, white chicks were the Wayans, brothers. Yeah, yeah. Genuinely, absolutely. Nothing more Wayne downtown. That made that yeah. song. Yeah, 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 yeah. Monetize, yeah. Monetize, monetize, monetize. Yeah, yeah, so you don't think monetize. Right? Oh, Did yeah. he just say that made that? Wait, 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 wait. That made that yeah. song. Yeah, 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 yeah. Monetize, yeah. monetize. monetize. Yeah, yeah. Did so you, you say that? Right? Oh, yeah, cool. Yeah. Uh, so I'm like, maybe I'm being stupid here. Q, thank you for the sub. Did that make that song bigger? I think rewatchability, I'd just choose it. It did. Fair enough. Right, Chicks for me is definitely probably one of my favorite movies ever, man. I'm your real favorite. Fair enough. I know your favorite film ever. It's called What's my favorite film? Uh, School of Rock. No, it's not. But it's High School Musical. <laughs> Choose one of four Premier League strikers. Yeah, I love this. This one. is the. This is a. No, this is basing on. Are you woken up? Are you woken up? Wait, 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 wait. before they even give yeah. options, are you man basing it off goals or just how you? No, no. I think what we should do is, I think we're all gonna have different players. Yeah. We explain why. Okay, okay, okay. 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 Go on. Okay. Yeah, Lord have mercy. Wait, man, just hear the Okay. I don't see it. Wait, wait. Go on, go on. Alan Shearer. Yeah, it's not my time. This one here. To see the man. Love, man. Wayne Rooney. Great, great player. Erling Haaland. Okay. I'm a good. So if you're talking about Erling Haaland now, if everyone. I'm between Rooney and Henri. Henri is just like, he's just class, isn't he? But Rooney just. Nah, I'm going on Ray. Going on Ray. Doesn't put Haaland, we've lost our minds. What? 
Three, two, one. Let's, okay, let's stop being yeah, stupid. Be Mr. Vava yeah. Boom. Thierry Henry. This is the reason. This yeah, is the yeah. reason I support Arsenal FC. Henry is, is yeah. like, Henry is just, a, he's smoother. He's a cooler guy. But Rooney has like an aura. To God, bro. Do you remember that celebration? As someone that said, Rooney has more aura. He shot a okay. free kick and he looks at the referee and goes, Yeah, yeah. Okay? He's trying to say, is that okay? Is yeah. that okay? Bro. Uh, here's a question. Do, did he have an iconic celebration? I don't think. Nice he like, had so many nice different like, ones, nice though. Like, like, like he'll tap his chest. Oh. He just had, he had swag. That's what it's how he felt like, on the day, innit? Choose one of four teams. Oh, okay. Ooh. I probably if haven't seen not... half of these. No, nah, brother. Ah! Can I just be I, honest with they, you? If I you guarantee if it's you not me. Not, yeah, if I know you're not me. Both of you. Yeah, if are you both not... excited over my wife and kids? Open the door, go close on. the door. Great Who... shot. Oh, listen, don't get go, me okay, mad. Go on, go on, go on. Go on, My wife and kids. Yeah! Hey, did... Has anyone seen that show? Did Harry just do the, uh... Open the door, close the door. I am so confused. That... Oh, that episode. Punch, stab, kill, bleed. Why is this the burp and kids so mad? Huh. I have no clue. But I'm sad. Anyone seen that? Or am I just waffling to myself? I think it's just me, isn't it? Just me, yep, just me. Uh, next time I talk to Harry, I'm going to bring this up. I'm going to just start, just go into that. Just you. Cool. Yeah, 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 yeah. Not my thing, really. Yeah. Friends. Horror. Oh. Rest in peace, Chandler. Yeah, I right, rest in peace. I said that. What, I was it? Who? I don't know. Matthew I don't watch all that. Yeah, yeah. Fresh Prince of Bel-Air. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Even that Where's Bel-Air? Bro, I can't lie. I can't rate more after all that stuff. Yeah, yeah. Like, or The Office. Ah, oh, if it's The Office US. If it's The Office US. If it's the UK. Don't need to talk about it. Friends for me is just like long term. It's always been like one of the best TV shows. The Office US. I can hear it. I can hear it. It is Fresh Prince hit a certain like time period for me, and so did My Wife and Kids. But I think just for longevity, I would I would say Friends. If you said to me which one do you want to watch an episode of right now, I'd pick Fresh Prince or My Wife and Kids. The Office. Don't, don't get me wrong. I'm not saying The Office isn't as good as Friends, if not better. I'm just saying if I had to pick one. For longevity, my whole life, friends. <laughs> oh, we've got a Because I didn't watch we've Office. We've got a serious... I didn't watch The Office till like a year ago. So I never really, like, I love it. And I think it's insane. I, like, I genuinely loved it so much. But I didn't watch it when I was younger or like whatever. So it's only, it's only just hit me. Situation there. That show helped me through my... You, thank you for the, for the five. Uh, just want to say, since I was 12, I'm now 21. You and the guys have helped me so much through the years. Hey, let's go. I hope you have a good Christmas day. Depression, bro. Wow. Yeah, yeah so oh, it's, 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 a, it's, it's a deep one. And you see how I do all of this? That's from that. Oh, is it? Yeah, breaking the fourth wall. That's what they call it. Right, I've got to explain mine quickly. Yeah. What's yours? Fresh. None of them shows hit me. <laughs> I was in my room, yeah. in the wank pit, 24-7. On Call of Duty, COD 4, no scoping across the map. That's what I was so on. What yeah. shows? They didn't really watch shows. That, hand on heart. Like, you know what it makes this, sense? This though? is a forced answer. Now yeah. break down your ones, because this All is right. what matters. All right, so for me, yeah, if you understand the concept of what my wife and kids is, yeah, it's the first show that we saw a black family, very, very rich, talking about the values of life, if you actually look at it properly. Oh, wow. That, that was, yeah, it was really, really incredible. Also, some of the iconic things and people that was on that show is crazy. Anyone has access to Damon Wayne? Oh, we would video, love to meet you. Bro. I genuinely would fly anywhere to meet this yeah. man. Please let me meet him. Damon He's Wayans. My my favorite actor of all time. Not my thing, man. What? 360, no scope. Yeah. I was going off. All right, that picture of you as a kid, oh, I thought, I thought it was AI. Oh, yeah. I don't know what picture. Yeah. <laughs> you yeah. Off. yeah. You're gonna and he's got glasses on. Yeah. Yeah. Right, on. <laughs> let me do that. All right, chill, man. Sure, sure. If Phillies are on, it will be on the screen. <laughs> oh Person is standing like this yeah. oh with, a bag. With, a, with a bag. Lost my mind. Nothing in that bag, but yeah, a jump. One thing, yeah. bro. Please send me that picture, man. <laughs> oh, great, great. I right, send it to Simon. All right, cool. Next time. Uh, choose one of four countries. Okay. For two weeks. Ooh. Countries of visit. Why is your voice Two weeks. <laughs> Right, look. No, 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 it's like, you're a big one, good. And then, uh, then, uh, good juice. Qatar. Okay. USA. Hate that place. Canada. Ooh! Australia. I mean, if I'm going anywhere for two weeks, I'd choose Australia. Out of those. Love Canada. I, if I could go to one of them for a visit, I'd say Canada. But two weeks, Australia. 
It depends. All right, cool. Let's, before we even write down, yeah, yeah, let's yeah. break down each country. Yeah. If I'm after darkness, yeah. I'm in Australia. Yeah, Australia for the Willy. Yeah, yeah, I yeah. Could be, I could be a US. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. US is dark yeah. as well. Everyone in the US has a woodamuff. Yeah, woodamuff. Like, yeah. What is woodamuff? What is it? A big bunda. Yeah, yeah. Woodum like, we call it woodamuff in my country. They just wobble. Woodum I don't get it. And it goes off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The yeah. backs just wobble. So it but, depends what I'm Australia, after. Australia, yeah. I preed everyone's toes. It's clear as day. Oh, yeah, 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 Australia's yeah, yeah. a great place. Right, so right. it depends what you're after. If I want peacefulness and actually spend time with my brothers, I'm going Qatar. All right, so after... Okay, so which one are you going? I haven't decided what I want the darkness. So, okay, it's how you feel right now. It's how you feel right now. Well, I've got two years of just slinging it, so I, think <laughs> I might just go darkness. Three, two, one. I'm guessing everyone's going to say my answer. Qatar. Yeah. Really yeah. like that place, man. Amazing. Yeah, yeah. One of the best places in the world I've ever been to, yeah. and I would love to retire there, inshallah. Inshallah. All right, so as you can see, we are ready for... Oh, this is smarter, you know. Going in the zone instead of on the line. Because we normally do like, the middle line is nothing. This line is somewhat disagree. This one is disagree and this one strongly disagree. But it actually makes sense because now you can't stay on the line. The statements, bring it on. You are happy with your height. Uh, I am... <laughs> happy with my what? I extremely I agree. To... Oh, <laughs> Strongly agree. <laughs> are you being honest? Huh? You're being honest? Yeah. Cool, man. I love that for you, bro. How, how tall are you? Six foot two. And, and, and if I'm six foot two as well... Bro, how... you're not. You're what, six man? four, at least. Uh, <laughs> you're six seven. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so six seven, six four, yeah? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, that's very logical, man. Yeah, yeah. I do agree with this statement because I am six two. I, I don't strongly agree because I'd love a six four, if I'm honest. Mm. Six four just sounds like sexy. Man, them, you guys nah, are... Nah, in... because, because I'm like skinny, I wouldn't want to be any taller. If I was six four, built like this, I actually would be slaying the man. They strongly agree. Yeah, yeah. So I'm, I'm, I'm gonna start with Harry. Harry, why do you I'm actually you? six three point two point five. So I'm just edging. So there's two points. Yeah, point three point oh, okay. two point yeah, five. Yeah. And I'm very happy. I can see everything, and um, it's flipping noise. <laughs> Billy. So yeah, that helps as well. Billy. Two sex. What? Right. <laughs> this guy's disgusting, man. Right? Yeah, I'm That's happy of my height. Six foot two, seven and a half inches. Girth on me. Left. Yeah. yeah. Um, could ask for more. Guys, I'm just here to tell you that he's a liar. Yeah. He's actually five foot ten. And there's nothing wrong with that. Billy, I'm happy for you, man. If, you, you, if you identify as six foot two, yeah, yeah, who am I to say? Liam, thank you for the bits. Yeah, there you go, man. Yeah. Right, play. Let's go back to the middle. Football was better before VAR. Ooh. I'd go somewhat agree. I'd go somewhat agree. Ah! Oh. I strongly agree. What do you say? Somewhat disagree. Okay, so I'm going to say somewhat agree. Now, I'm going to start off. I do I, agree yeah. that football was better before AAR, VAR, sorry. Same. But the reason I'll tell you maybe not so because of the fact that we've seen so much robberies happen. And That's for me, it's like, imagine Lampard's goal counting. I just think that the problem with VAR is the actual officials that we have. Okay. It's so, not the actual yeah, VAR itself. Agree, because agree. we have the worst referees in the world for a league that's actually known as the best in the world. So it just doesn't make sense for me. My uh, disagreement with that is, uh, with VAR, they've had ample time to be able to work really, really hard to actually get it right. Some of the decisions have cost massive, massive like problems for the league, for positions, for teams and everything else. And I think for, for an establishment not to get it right. And for example- That isn't VAR though, that was goal line tech. Well, it'd be both, right? Like, goal line tech, it still would have gone to VAR as well as goal line tech. I know, well, I, I know, yeah, I know it's different, but it still is. I think it's kind of included in that. Goal line was before VAR. Yeah. The Newcastle game, bro. Like, but I think just, it's like... The ball is clearly off the pitch, but because a little bit of it is... Even still. Rashford's uh, um, getting sent off the other day. Yeah. Like, no, no, me, no, look, 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 look. I can just, bro, you can just hit it with, all right, World Cup. Was there any mad decisions that you thought, oh my God, that shouldn't happen? But that's yeah. elite referees though. Yeah, but that's what I'm trying to say. That's, yeah, that's, but, so but it's not a problem with the VAR. I, I, I'm not a fan of VAR because it's not at its, its highest level right now. The reason why we needed VAR was because you're you're trying to base it off the naked eye. And yeah, as human beings, difficult, and as bro. human beings, it's possible you're to gonna do so, yeah. But Chloe, VAR, think for the example, had too many problems for the amount of money that has been spent and the amount of how much we're, we're relying on it in games. I think the people that, PGMO, that are sitting in that flipping yeah, tiny room. Referees, I don't blame them. because I like the referees. I like those I mean, it's their, crazy their fault. decisions. They're the one that's watching the screen for taking right. 70 seconds to decide. You think oh, keep VAR off offsides and leaves, leave everything else to on-field? Uh, yeah. But then something like a huge mistake will happen that something else and they'll go, this is why we should have had VAR. 
They've been told, they've been told that still images is what they look at. So for example, if I do this, yeah. it looks like I banged you in your yeah, face, yeah, yeah. but I haven't. A decision could go mad against you, bro, over VAR. And that's not fair, innit? Like, I hear what you're saying. You, you boys, both of you watch way more football than I do anyway. Someone scored, but it was clearly offside. If VR didn't exist, then that, do you get what I'm saying to you? Like, I think it's just fair. I think over a matter of time, there's gonna be, there's gonna be a, like people, that actual team. Like, a way to get doing. trained and, yeah, yeah, yeah. and then, And then next time when we film this video, I could be over here. Okay. That's why I'm when somewhat agree. When succeed, it's because of hard work. Luck has nothing to do with success. Uh, I disagree. I don't strongly disagree. That's a crazy statement. Luck has nothing to do with success. Yeah, yeah I disagree. I don't strongly disagree because I think, like, I, I think I have to disagree because you have to get lucky in order to do that. But I do, I'm not strongly disagree because I do also think that you can also kind of just like make something happen, if you know what I mean. Like you might get lucky to get put in a position, but that doesn't mean you're successful. Whereas if you work hard, you can get successful. Like some, yeah. I'd go, I'd go disagree, but not strongly disagree. That's, that's mental. I'm gonna strongly disagree with that because I feel like, for example, I went to the Sidemen party, right? Um, not yeah, expecting to see anybody. Who did I come across? Stuart, yeah, which is the Sidemen's manager. I Please. initially went out there just to enjoy myself. Chris, stayed with 23 he months. was there and I managed to have a conversation with him and he ended up becoming my manager, which then got me to where I am today. Like helped, a big, big help as to why that's I'm here today. Yeah. Do you know what I'm trying to say? And Tim, save that prime. was because of luck. You know what I mean? Had you not worked hard, you wouldn't have been at that party. Yeah, I get it. Do you get what I'm saying? I'm saying that, but if he wasn't there, I wouldn't so, have met so, so, Yeah, but is it luck? Because you worked hard is the reason you was at that party. Do you yeah. know what I'm saying? No, I get it, I get it. But then it's also, I said fate as well. Like, that's what I mean. I don't, I don't know if I'd consider like, him going to a party that Stuart's at and them talking. I don't know if I even consider that luck. Like you can say, oh, it's lucky that we met there. But realistically, it's, it's just very likely. For example, you being friends with KSI is lucky, but he has other friends who didn't make it like you. That's what I mean. Like, yes, that was lucky, the, the fact that we were good friends. But yeah, he had other friends. I think, I think, to say, yeah, to say luck has nothing to do with it. Who's Stuart? Stuart. To say luck has nothing to do with it, I would strongly disagree. But to say like, uh, maybe I would strongly disagree because yeah, to say it has nothing to do with it. I don't know. Do you know what I mean? So it is a weird one. Could we I say that like hard work forms luck? No, because a lot of people have worked, worked really, so really hard, hard and, and they're not moving. Oh, anywhere. fair. So that's, true. that was that was going to be my oh, thing. fair point. The fact yeah. that like that was going to be my point because I feel like you can work really, really hard, but nothing can work for you. Mm. Luck is something that like, for example, I feel very lucky that I met you lot because you lot helped my career. That wouldn't happen if I didn't work hard, of course. Do but you know but the luck. Because the thing is, right? Someone could. Someone could start YouTube tomorrow, and just figure out the algorithm through pure brains they just go oh i know what i know what i need to do make the videos they do well they can say oh it's lucky that they you know they blew up and got into people suggested but it's not actually luck luck aspect of it is the fact that liban was like oh share this to you yeah and randomly he was just like you know i'm gonna dm you so it's like those little things happen when you're working hard i think if you don't work hard you don't get luck what was the question again one more time yeah, you so work for your luck when people succeed it's because of hard work Luck has nothing to do with yeah, it. Yeah, nothing. Just, luck has nothing, which is, I think it's crazy. So for example, now footballers, how many footballers have made it because of the fact that their dad knows someone in the yeah, system? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And they, they're nowhere is near that as good as somebody else that works ah, so yeah, hard, yeah, yeah. but they're lucky to have that. We all next. agree. You know, we all agree. Yeah, I know, but yeah, I, yeah, just, we're all yeah, you're yeah. just yeah. I just think it's just so it's many the word facets, nothing. and there's so many times where luck has shown that they've helped someone's career more than their actual skill. Do you know what I think? Yeah, I just think That's sometimes. God as well, man. God oh me. my God! Yeah, you yeah, took yeah. the words yeah, from yeah. my mouth. God you know has I mean? on the grand scheme of things, it's yeah. It's, it's that. the fact God that has it, everyone's it lives to do planned out and written. Like I really wanted to be a footballer. Didn't happen. God didn't want that time. Do you get what I'm saying? Yeah. Look how like, I feel like I feel like we're now work with every single. We're talking from a perspective of faith, isn't it? I'm saying just trying to minus that and actually think just devil's advocate and just try to think. Without all them extra, like, you know what I mean? Yeah. In some way, the Simon were lucky because the whole world was forced to stay inside, but you guys still had to work hard to take advantage of the situation. Well, no, because you, you don't know what we could have done, for example, during that lockdown period where we were still posting and more people were watching. We 
if we weren't locked in, we could have gone and done even better videos and then maybe even more people would watch. So that, you don't, that's the thing. You don't know how the other situation goes. Same way, like, Chunks meeting Stuart has literally, like, made him massive. But at the same time, he could have met someone else and that could have done it. You know what I mean? Like, there's so many different things. JJ's YouTube channel might not have taken off and you'd say, oh, it was un it's unlucky if that happened. But then he could have been huge elsewhere. I don't know. You know, uh, you never know what the other way is. KSI is more famous than Tyson Fury. Ooh. Yeah. 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 I'm going to get hate for this one. Ooh. I'd go somewhat agree. Somewhat agree. Ooh, interesting. I feel like you just follow chunks, but that's what you do in your life anyway. So, um, <laughs> why do you agree? Let's start with you since you... Yeah, I'm out of your mind. <laughs> you know, just let that happen. Gen Z, I think he has that under control. I think the fact that they've sold a billion primes across the world says a lot. He's doing with the boxing as well. I think uh, people watch that more than probably they watched the Tyson Fury fight the other day as well. As an athlete, obviously Tyson Fury is a worldwide athlete. But I'm sure if you went to most kids and said, who's KSI? They would know who he is. So then why are you not here with me? I'm also giving him credit saying he's a household name, uh, Tyson Fury. Yeah, there's like, no doubt in my no mind. No doubt. Oh. Yeah. Oh. But I agree that I think KSI is. But I'm still hailing up Tyson. Yeah. You get me? Amazing guy, especially as a, a person. I've had the pleasure of, of meeting him a couple times. But yeah, I strongly agree that KSI is. It's hard. The I thing is, it is, it is hard to judge it when you're in the bubble. You're in the KSI bubble, not, yeah. But JG has literally been huge in the boxing scene. Maybe not the like, it's obviously not the, the title fight boxing scene, but he is huge in the boxing world now. He's also huge in the music world, huge in the online entertainment world. Like, <sighs> yeah. So I agree, because um, if you're just looking at total followers amassed, like if you look at all social media, Gen Z, of course, like you said yourself, I feel like that's taken over. But then with the older demographic, Tyson Fury has got more than names. I think Case has transitioned into the boxing scene, which will give him the older audience. And I feel like the older audience, their kids, Chronic and nieces three months. and nephews, etc., have have got to know who KSI is by force. So why are you not here? Here's because what... of the fact that there's still variables that could potentially mean that yeah. Tyson's got that generational lock. Yeah. Oh, you get it? Which is why I agree. Yeah, but. I don't strongly agree. I wish I was there. But anyway, I made my decision. <laughs> All right, let's go. A man Huge in boxing, not comparable to the people who watch Tyson's boxing. Let's not act crazy with that one. Did I say that? But also, he would be pretty big. He literally, he fought one of the Furies. So it was literally, like, it was pitched to Tyson Fury's fan base as well. And then, like, Deji fought Mayweather. So it's like, people that actually watch boxing would have paid, would have seen, at least that these people are fighting these people. And like, even if they don't like him, they'll definitely have like heard about him. A man should pay for dinner on the first date. Uh, I'm going to go somewhat disagree. Dinner on the first date. Somewhat disagree. And my reasoning oh. is, I don't think they should do anything. Whoever, whoever asked out the person, should pay. That's that's my logic. Like I would always offer to pay, but I'd go somewhat disagree. Oi. Yeah, should. Should is Let me tell you where I stand with that. If you wanna pay or go hard, run that up. Yeah. Yeah. I'm not dumb. Yeah. So that's why I'm saying somewhat agree. Like I'm not the guy that's gonna go, no, 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 don't, 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 don't. I'm gonna pay, I'm gonna pay. Like, it's not that deep for me, bro. If yeah. you wanna split the bill with me, or if you now insist on paying, run that up. I think it depends on the, what type of situation it is. So if I've initiated that I'm, I'm going to take you out, then mm. of course I'm going to agree. You know what I'm So how saying? can you strongly so agree? So what I'll say is, you're right, I'll, you just I said, agree. You know what I mean? Yeah. I'm going to strongly agree because I'll always pay for the date. I don't know, I'm, I'm traditional. Yeah, yeah. Um, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, tradition. <laughs> on my dad's birthday, my mum picked the restaurant and everything. Yeah. My dad paid. <laughs> <laughs> so, is yeah. It? yeah, I was so confused. I'm bringing out my card first. I'm not even expect. But if you're telling me you want to pay, run it up. That's the thing, I would, I would always pull out my car first. I'll be like, yeah, I'll pay. But if you said, yeah, you should pay. Hell no. All right, well, That's I fair. strongly yeah. agree with my brother. Chance. HB is too old to not be true. Footballers are the most skilled sports people. <laughs> nah, strongly disagree. Strongly. I would say, no, strongly is mad. My reasons being, you boys know, I'm a new fan of F1 and I absolutely love the sport. My mum can kick a ball. 
obviously not to the level that David Beckham so can kick a ball. So we're talking can about professional that? football players? Yeah. My mum can't kick a ball to the level that David Beckham can, but she could defo kick it. My mum can't get in the F1 car and hold eight G-force on the net at 200 <laughs> mile an hour. Yeah. It's not happening, bro. Yeah. So what would you say then is the most complex sport to, to learn? Potentially UFC. Think about it. when you're fighting, you have to think about the punching, you have to think about the elbows, the knees, then you also have to think about ground defense. You have yeah, to think about I, I'm not gonna lie, the Philly logic there weren't, wasn't like, that weren't right. Because realistically, his mum kicking a ball to a Premier League footballer is the same as his mum going go karting. Like, she could drive an F1 car, but she's not gonna go that fast. Same way she can kick a ball, but she's not gonna be able to do skills and. Hit it at top bins. I know football isn't just kicking a ball. Yeah, gymnastics is... Yeah. Yeah, I... Uh, How to avoid getting dropped on the floor. They're all just different skills, aren't they? You have to now get out of locks. It's like so much... I oh, feel like happening one with time. UFC, yeah. you're learning every single day more and more and no, more man, about sport. Whereas for I think the football, once you kind months, of peak, okay. you're not learning more about your football ability, but it's more about what you can add to your game. I was thinking of other things, like, like boxing, for example. Once you get banged in your face, yeah. If any of us get banged in the face by a boxer, we're sleeping. Jaw's gone. Last question, I believe, it <laughs> is the internet has brought people closer together. Oh. I'd agree. Yeah, I'd agree. I went strongly. What? Very soon. Come on now. This wouldn't happen without the internet. I've become friends with these two. Brothers, because of the internet, I feel oh, like racing, that's because yeah. it's yeah. also yeah. made Come people on, like let's, let's it's also and even people. bigger and deeper. People have got married through apps. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm trying to say? You don't know how much I love Man United, yeah? yeah. I wouldn't have met the likes of Rio Ferdinand and Paul Scholes if not for the internet. Just in case, like we, we don't know. Look at look at how we went to Australia and the love that we received. That's the other side of the world. Yeah, that's the internet. Yeah. And and obviously back in the day, for example, it was only TV. Like Spice Girls, for example, they were global just because everyone's watching it on TV. Now it's quick. Like everything is so on demand. So yeah. The and during and during COVID, how much did the internet help people keep that keep their same like? Keep saying this. Well, thanks for you know, taking everything much? I wanted to say, boys. Sorry, bro. And what would you say, bro? Yeah. Well, That's great. Exactly. Um, at the end of the day, yeah, for me, I want to do this on my main channel now. It's the reason that really is in this is because it kind of it echoes what we kind of trying yeah, to talk yeah, about. Yeah, you know, yeah. And the like, ethos has been uh, distributed. Getting your wife from internet, mm. for, getting bridges from internet, even Running money from internet. like. But then, oh, flip side. Thing is, I'm I'm really busy in January, so I, I might have to just. I've already recorded the stadium video. Uh. I might only have like two videos in January, realistically. And then starting Feb, I might have to just kind of be like, all right, let's run a bunch. Propaganda for the Wanda. There's been propaganda on the match, but then propaganda was about even before the internet. But even more so, for example, when things happen in the world, like for example, what's happening in Palestine, yeah. it's brought a lot of Muslim people together. Yeah, yeah, no, it's places. positives and negatives because yeah. now the people that are, that are spewing their nonsense and their propaganda is bringing guests to again. Oh yeah, I wouldn't do this video on my own. I think this video on my own would be like, it'd be a bit more, it's like second channel on my own. Internet to be able to do that. Cause now when people are saying, oh my God, this happened. It could even, it could even be false, but now because it's in the news, you just believe it. But then even though I'm here and I agree, yeah. Wouldn't you say it's kind of pulled people away as well at the same time, yeah? Let's say we're at dinner for an hour. We're on our phone for 20 minutes of that dinner. That's cause I need to check up on my phone. Okay, but more time, you're a little scroller. Yeah, I like scrolling. And like even now, all the youths are playing Fortnite. Back in the days, it was knock, knock, knock. It's Philly coming to play but out. But they're also playing online with each other. That makes them together. Oh, but yeah, then yeah. also it does ruin their actual social skills. Yeah. Does it, Danny? Danny? About the oh internet, God. it just actually... You have no bread without the internet. You know what? <laughs> you know, we're going to have a pot. Yeah. Not one <laughs> pot. We're going to have a pot. Yep. Yeah. I think about it, without internet, where, where would you be right now, honestly? Outside Baker Lou Lion. Yeah. Got three five, three five, three five. Man. Three five. So he'd be yeah. selling uh, narcotics. Yeah, what yeah. would you be doing? In my wank pit. Yeah. On games twenty four seven. Mum pissed a pit. off I ain't got a job. Yeah. Get oh, twenty eight got a job. Yeah. yeah. I'm in the yard playing games. Would you be? I think I'd still be all right. Did he just say where would he be without the internet? And Philly's talking about I'd be online playing multiplayer COD. Yeah. Please, you know what? I'm, I'm lying. I just said for jokes. You know what I'd be doing, actually? Yeah. I'd probably be in psychology, you know, because that was actually my job before this stuff. Guys, I genuinely worked in the prison as a mentor. Yeah, that... If you needed Zed, bro, five years ago, he had you, man. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you so much.
Friday yeah, bro, not out. unless. He ain't leaving his yard for nothing less. <laughs> 28 G's only. Oh, I'm screwed. All right, well, uh, there you have it. That is the question. end of the video. I just want to say thank you so much for watching. Make sure you click the like. Click subscribe as well. I'm trying to get like 4 this, you know. million subscribers. <laughs> um, but yeah, any, any last word, man? Yeah, um, please follow my brother Harry Panera because he needs to touch a million followers. Yes. yes. And also, me and Philly have a podcast as well. Yes, so yes, yes, yes. Have a little ganja you know and what? make sure you also watch Inside Scoop, which yeah. is Harry's I'd love podcast. To be, I'd love to be a guest on your podcast, man. We're going to do episode two. Yeah. No, but this is probably going to come out. We don't know yet. Out. Okay, well, yeah. we, we record a run. Yeah. 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 do, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and um, no hate. Sounds good to you. Yeah, boy. Good video. Loved it. I love videos like that where there's I can I can interact, you know.